Lord Susan and Manu Malfan who wrote the music and these wonderful musicians here as well and our good friend Adrian Peacock who's producing Anyway, Susan did, you, Susan, did you want to say something? Yes. Okay. Yes. Teensy Williams. So, hello everyone. Hi. So, my name is Susan Lim. And on behalf of co-creator Christina Teens, hello, <laughs> composer, orchestrator, and arranger Manu Matan, project manager Matthew Amad, and executive producer and my soulmate Deepak Sharma, a very warm welcome to you, London Voices, and director Ben Perry. It is just wonderful to see so many familiar faces from our last recording um, in Abbey Road, I think it was November 2019. And although two years have passed, it does seem that we've kind of been in touch through your wonderful playlist, This is London Voices. And I really want to thank Ben Perry and uh, Terry Edwards for including six tracks from the fantasy of companionship on your amazing playlist. <laughs> so um, this past week, we have been recording music of the Cosmic Rhapsody with pianist Johnny Thibaudet and the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra conducted by Robert Ziegler. And uh, really today, we are so excited to be including your voices for the added human dimension that will give our cosmic rhapsody a lift off to the far reaches of this planet and beyond. So um, our producer was, Ben has said, our producer for the cosmic rhapsody is the Grammy nominated Adrian Peacock. <laughs> hey Adrian. <laughs> Adrian has produced three uh, of our previous recordings here in Studio One, and he is joined by co-producer, Manuel Martin. We have a wonderful team of sound engineers, uh, Dan Hayden and Marta Dinazzi, helmed by Stefano Civetta, who really has engineered all of our music since we first arrived here in Abbey Road back in 2016. So the theme of the cosmic Rhapsody is a future companionship of human and inanimate in space on a mission to find solutions for planet Earth's environmental crisis and save the human race. Well, it's one thing for Christina and I to write the script, but quite another to put it into music. And I know I've said it before, but I still find myself without enough words to describe my admiration and gratitude to composer, orchestrator, and arranger, Manu Martin. Manu, it's been a wonderful experience to work with you and with Matthew Imad these past 12 to 18 months. And both uh, Christina and I have felt your sensitivity and quite frankly, your musical brilliance as you, um, as you interpreted our every word, almost, certainly every intention into musical notes. But all this while going through one of the most major personal health crises for which you have come out strong and from all of us, yeah, a big um, so the music of the Cosmic Rhapsody draws inspiration from 16 songs composed during the most trying of times in solitude and virtual collaboration across three continents. And today I really want you to meet the composers composers <laughs> of the songs which underlie the tracks that you are about to sing. And there's some details in your 
souvenir badges. Um, and what I'll do is I'll also name uh, at least one track, one track for each of the composers just to give some context. So first off, I guess you have to meet him virtually, Joy Barua from Assam, India for Is Anybody Out There? And next, Ron Danziger <laughs> from Los Angeles, California for Humanimates. Uh, Matthew Amard from France for Beam Me Up. Manu Martin from Bordeaux, France for Cosmic Bods. And uh, Christina Teens from Los Angeles for the language of Song of the Lost Tribe. Uh, we, the Cosmic Rhapsody just would not be complete without participation from brilliant musicians on the Allen team. And so joining you on two tracks are uh, our solo voices, um, Joy Barua and Matthew Amar, and our amazing musicians, Jerome B on electric We would like to thank you, uh, London Voices, for breathing life into our cosmic rhapsody so that we may share it with the rest of the world and beyond. Um, then I have an article. We have champagne and I want it here. Was it served at lunch? No, they won't want champagne. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> at lunchtime? Whoa, okay. <laughs> but, but, <laughs> I like that, okay. But we do have, Christina and I have organized that we, and the whole team, that we do have um, Asahi bowls, Harrods cakes, and a sip of champagne at the end of the first session. Yep, okay. So thank you very much. <laughs> Enjoy the recording. Thank you very much.